my friends it's Raya welcome back to my channel and I just want to start off by saying thank you guys for the almost 4k on my first story time so I'm just gonna go ahead and do another story time and this one is just gonna be about how I um got my first hickey <laughs> and Jose is laying right there so he gets to hear this story too hey bae So, how I got my first hickey and the repercussions of that hickey. So, just some backstory. This happened when I was 14. Don't judge me. It was a little bit too much. Probably shouldn't have been happening, but it happened. Whatever. So, um, we're going to call, like, my little... So, okay, wait. Let me just back up. Boyfriends back when I was like in elementary school was just like you bring me a CNC soda pineapple to school and maybe like a sandwich we split a cold cut sandwich <laughs> in school and then you were my boyfriend so that's how that was in elementary school now when you got in high school it was a little bit different those boys don't want to just bring you a CNC soda they want you to catch them and all that extra stuff so fast forward to we're gonna call him Tyrese my ninth grade boyfriend Tyrese he lived he lived like three houses down from me, like the left of me, and my nana uh, lived across, right directly across the street from my mom's house. Uh, she lived in like a little housing complex, so it was like seven houses, and she was like the first house towards the left. So Tyrese lived right across from her. Um, one day, it was like raining outside, and if you know me, you know my Nana stays in the window regardless. Rain, sun, sleet, snow, whatever. She stays in the window because she's nosy. She's looking at every single thing that's going on. So I'm on the phone with Tyrese and I'm like, yeah, I'm not going to be able to see you today. It's raining. Like, we're not going outside. Nobody's going outside. Birdie isn't going outside. Blah, 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 blah. He's like, well, you could just meet me in your Nana backyard. And I'm like... Nana is at the window like she can see you leave out the house she can see me leave out the house what are you talking about he like no just watch out when she get out the window you just come across the street so my mother told me not to go outside <laughs> she told me not to go outside she wasn't home it was just me and my sisters and my brother she asked me not to go outside I was being hard headed hard headed I was 14 what did you expect so she asked me not to go outside but um I wasn't gonna listen because you know that was my boyfriend. I, he wanted to see me. We was going to go outside. It was raining or not. So, uh, my nana was in the window. I'm on the phone. And we're like, okay, bet. We're going to do this. I hang up the phone. I'm just staring out the window. Just looking. <laughs> and then I see Tyrese jet across the... His house is right here. My house is right here. Nana's house is right here. I see him jet across the street into my nana's backyard. So, he's in the backyard. And I'm like, how am I get in the backyard? Luckily, my Nana's best friend, Miss Cal, who lives at the last house on the little housing strip, she's walking to the store. She yells up, she yells to my Nana's window, Miss Torch, you want something from the store? My Nana like, no, Cal, I don't need nothing from the store. I'm about to go to the bathroom. Okay, Miss Torch, I'll see you later. <laughs> Okay, get it together, right? So, <laughs> you can let no way. You can literally hear all this happening. So, next thing you know, my nana like, Birdie, come help me go to the bathroom. So, I'm like, oh, this is my chance. So, you see nana not at the window. I book it down the stairs. We lived on the third floor of a three-family house. I had on slippers and I, no coat. Mind you, it's raining. Not like a heavy rain, but like a drizzle. I book it across the street. In the backyard. Tyrese is just waiting right there. So, I'm like, oh, hey, da da da, miss you. Hugs, all that stuff. So, sorry, babe. It's gonna get a little, huh. <laughs> um, you start to kind of make out. A little bit. Uh, so I'm just used to just like regular kissing and then he starts to kiss my neck. So I'm like, mm, mm. I think Birdie had a hickey before. So I obviously knew what him right here in this area kissing would do, but it's like, 
You know how you're about to get in an accident and you know you're about to get in an accident but you can't do anything to stop it? Exactly what was happening. So, I get the hickey. My mother is not home yet. Somehow, I managed to make it back across the street. We were outside for like 45 minutes. Like 45 minutes in the rain. Just being grown. Like ridiculously grown. If you're 14, do not do it. Learn from my mistakes. But we were being ridiculously grown. So I managed to get back across the street. And I clearly am not in the mirror. So I clearly don't see it yet. But when I walk in the house, my sister Shayad is like, Oh! What's that on your neck? Next to you know, my sister Kiki like, Oh! I'm telling! I'm telling! And my little brother, Fat Alki, he was fat back then. He was like, <clears throat> call mommy right now call her right now and I'm like no no don't tell her don't no no what y'all want what y'all want I swear to god like y'all want dollar I got y'all go to the store da -da 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 -da. so I'm just like please don't tell her please please and my sister Shaeja she loves me like deep down inside but she really won't ever say it uh she's like y'all shut up just relax like because she know if my father find out it is the end of my life. Like, the end of my life. Like, you wouldn't know, Raya. Like, if my father found out about that hickey, you would not know me. But, so, she just calmed him down. And I'm like, oh, my God. What am I going to do? The hickey is no lie, guys. The hickey is no lie like this big. No lie. I don't even remember how. I remember clearly how it happened. But I don't know how it got that big. So, it was literally, like, this big. So me and Shaedra are like trying the cold frozen spoon trick. I call a birdie over there, my cousin. We trying stuff. Next thing you know, it's like, okay, makeup. Let's put makeup on it. This was the first time I think I bought makeup. It was really, really cheap. It was from IGA. It was like, <laughs> it was like a, IGA is like a little mini mall, like in our neighborhood. From the beauty supply store, Concealer was not my color. I thought I was getting foundation, but it was concealer. Luckily, I made that mistake and got concealer. So, it was not really even my color. It was, I think, too dark or it was too light. So, I put the concealer on and it looks better than a purple red mark on my neck. I'm wearing hoodies. I'm wearing turtlenecks, like legit turtlenecks. This was like for four days. The fifth day. Dumb Mariah forgets about the hickey. So I'm on the phone with my cousin Day Day. Hey girl. I'm on the phone like, yeah, because Tyrese da 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 da. My mother knew I had a boyfriend. My daddy didn't know. So my mother was following me having a boyfriend. She, did, she didn't like it, but she was like, okay, but well, I was going to have a boyfriend regardless. My daddy did not know, guys. So I'm on the phone like, yeah, da 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 da, Tyrese da 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 da. She like, da 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 da, yeah, because this boy name is Aki and da 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 da. So. My mother is just sitting on the couch. I don't know what she was doing. I forgot. And I'm just yeah, there was a couch right here and a couch right here. I'm on this couch. She like, Mariah, come here. I'm like, what? Mariah, come here. So I'm like, okay. Yeah, day day, da 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 da. Walking over to her. She's like, come here, get out. I was like, okay, day day, hold on. She like, what? Mariah, what lift, lift your head up. Right then and there, I'm like, oh, shit. Next thing you know, it's like, whoop! She slapped the holy hell shit out of me. Like, she slapped the shit out of me. Like, she literally slapped the shit out of me. That was the first time my mother ever fucking hit me. And she slapped the dog shit out of me. Like, so hard, she left her handprint on my face, slapped the shit out of me. And she just looking at me like, that's a fucking hickey. And I'm like, she said, no, don't hang up the phone. Let daddy hear you cry. <laughs> don't hang up the phone. Let daddy hear you cry. What type of shit is that? So I'm like, it's not a hickey. Mariah lied to me again, and I'm going to slap you again. <gasps> but it's not a and I'm like, oh. <laughs> crying. And Day Day just silent on the phone. Like, just silent. Not saying a motherfucking word. Because she 
knows about the hickey. Everybody knows about the hickey. And let's just turn around to my brothers and sisters back there at the back hallway peeking around the door watching. Like snakes. Like y'all knew what was happening. Don't be trying to act surprised like y'all wondering why I got slapped. But she slapped the shit out of me. And I'm not going to lie to you and say like that slap made me not get any more hickeys because I still was having hickeys. <laughs> I just was trying to hide them better. After my mother slapped me, she put me on punishment. I was on punishment for like, she said two weeks. I think I was on punishment for like two days. <laughs> Um, but yeah, she put me on punishment. She did not tell my father, luckily. But, um, my dad did, I got another hickey, like, later on that he did find out about. But, you know, that's a story time for another time, if y'all want to hear it. But, yeah, that's the story of my first hickey. Um, it was not worth it. <laughs> it was definitely not worth it. Worth it. That was the first time my mother ever put her hands on me. She slapped the dog shit out of me, and I will never, ever, ever forget it. Uh, you guys really like my story times, and I appreciate it. And so that's why I'm doing another story time. Just makes sense, guys. It just makes sense. So, yeah, that's it for today. That's it for today's story time. And thank you guys for watching. And just make sure you comment, like, and subscribe. Even if your comment's really nasty, like, you know who you are, you're leaving nasty comments on my videos, but, like, it really doesn't matter to me because I really have, like, legit tough skin. Like, I give two shits. <laughs> but, yeah. Bye, guys.